Now, the new year is upon us. It's a time where we often set new goals for ourselves. And with the holiday season now beginning to wind down, January often brings a financial crunch as holiday spending leaves many pockets rather empty and unpaid bills start piling up. But with a little forward planning, you can make 2024 a financially smoother year for yourself. And to give us some insight and some direction with regards to finances and how you can make 2024 a financially successful year for you, we are joined this morning by John Manike. He is Head of Financial Education at Old Mutual. Mr. Manike, Happy New Year to you. And thank you so much for joining us. You are just the man that we want to be speaking to today after the holidays have uh, left many of us a little bit poorer. Happy New Year to you too, sir. Happy New Year to you, and thanks for having me, Tammy. Well, th this is something that, that you do. And, and as we begin our conversation today, one of our listeners, Leo, uh, said this in, in, a, in a comment that he sent to us. He says, I can't control how the year will play out, but I can determine how I prepare and respond to it. I really need to budget better. Give every rand an assignment or it will leave you for someone else and you will wonder where it went. I found that very insightful and mm -hmm. I found that very wise. Is that true in, in, in your experience? No, absolutely. I, and I think we need to normalize uh, budgeting. I mean, if, if New Year's re resolutions were anything to go by, this is certainly one of those financial disciplines that we need to uh, put in place. I mean, when I look at uh, some of the uh, surveys that we conducted uh, last year, out of a sample of 1,100 people, 93% uh, of them claimed that they were budgeting, but 72% of them said they don't stick to that budget. 